I'd like to share some information about the Minnesota Zoo. There's been quite a bit of information in the local papers and uh, news uh, media outlets recently. And of course, the Minnesota Zoo is a state agency and it's located in District 57, my Senate district. I think one of the important things is to recognize that the Minnesota Zoo is a governmental agency. And as such, we are responsible for funding. I think there's three primary reasons that the zoo is really having some financial difficulty right now. The first is adequate funding. In the past, when the zoo was first uh, recognized and organized, the state contributed approximately 33 to 34 percent of its total operating budget. And that's fallen over the years to 22 percent. So the zoo has really been developing over the years a public-private partnership uh, to make up uh, funding uh, deficiencies. So that's number one. Number two is that the state recently uh, settled a contract uh, with state employees. This is something that's out of control of uh, zoo uh, personnel and uh, CEO. And when that was settled, it was for a 5% increase and the zoo budget uh, had 3%. So now we are falling behind as you look at budget. And the third reason is something that I think we've all experienced in Minnesota last year, and that is we had a very poor weather uh, in the spring and into the summer, and that cut down on uh, the uh, admissions to the zoo, the number of people that were visiting. Traditionally, in Minnesota has about 1.2 million visitors to the zoo. It contributes $147 million in added revenue from people that come to visit the zoo, zoo and uh, spend time in uh, hotels and restaurants, uh, filling their cars with gas, etc. And so it's a real economic generator as well. We are going to be hearing uh, some bills in the upcoming weeks uh, to appropriate $1.5 million in additional funding currently that's needed for the zoo. And then we'll be looking a little bit more long range at the zoo uh, funding. The zoo is also uh, going through a bonding proposal. Uh, there are some upgrades that is needed uh, in infrastructure at the zoo and also to attract more visitors, always looking at exhibits and increasing uh, what might be some of the main attractions. The zoo has uh, just completed a major study uh, looking for future needs and they'll be implementing that uh, with their board over the next several months. So I hope that answers some of the questions that people have been uh, sending me about the zoo. Uh, the zoo is a great uh, economic generator but it's also a great addition to the quality of life here for Minnesotans. So. I hope uh, all of you have a chance to get out and visit the zoo in the upcoming year. Thank you.